Hello, good afternoon everybody. This is Mike. I thought I'd show you my latest project. And people probably remember I did take the video down. Um, I was running this Apple iMac 2006 era with the Core Dual 1.83 gigahertz processor. I just want to show you how well this particular computer runs uh, Windows 10. And Windows 10 right now for this machine is my, win my, my operating system of choice. It does run Windows 7 quite well. What you do is you download the boot camp drivers and it does run well. But I find it even runs just as well with Windows 10. And with Windows 10 I get to run the latest browsers. And I wanted to compare that with uh, Snow Leopard. Nothing wrong with Snow Leopard. I think it's a fine operating system. In fact, um, some people do boot this particular computer with 7. Um, that's all well and good, but I have to admit, uh, Snow Leopard, I don't like hunting around 6 years for software. Um, I just find it very tiring, and I was happy to find out through uh, tutorials. Tutorials on uh, YouTube, how to get Windows 10 on this device. If you can do it through flash drive, more power to you, but I found it's better to, for me, like other people have found it's better to go through the super drive. It will even boot through, if you have a nice one, it will even boot through the through a ex external uh, DVD drive if you have Windows on there. So I have booted it. It will boot, but the super drive is by far the easiest. Anyway, I just wanted to show you how easy some of these things were right now I'm looking at a YouTube video and I find it plays YouTube quite well there might be some lag on uh, full time or full screen and it doesn't always run 720p that well depends on what's in the video but I found for this particular computer since I have other computers that are far more powerful 480p is just fine anyway um, let me see. This is Mr. Cook, who I follow. Eventually, I will probably be talking about electric cars. Um, I know a lot of people know me from Twitter, or some people know my Twitter feed, and some of my follow me on Google Plus that I do post or retweet things on electric cars. I will probably be starting my own uh, commentary on electric cars before long. Anyway. Uh, it would probably be from a different perspective because at the moment I don't have an electric car so uh, but I, I do uh, follow electric cars I do follow to a certain extent Formula E and uh, I hope to get an electric car one day and if anyone hope to review an electric car before too long anyway what I thought I would do is uh, hope Mr. Cook will forgive me for using this video Maybe I should use one of mine. Uh, let's see. Let's go use one of my videos here. Uh, well, I guess it's probably that's <laughs> probably gone if you think about it because I've already showed him on mine. But anyway, here's my video, one of my videos. We'll see how it works. As you can see, it. It works quite well. Anyway, this is uh. Anyway, this is just an option. If you don't want to mess around with Snow Leopard, and you want to run the latest software, and you have the Core Dual, you can run the 32-bit uh, software, or if you have the Core 2 Dual, you can run the 64. I'm sure the 64-bit processor will run even better, but you put at least two gigs, you can run Windows 10. Anyway, have a good day.